Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, uh, Random Sync 7, where we talk about bikes, gear reviews, and uh, travel within the Northeast. Uh, yeah, so, if you do like the content, please, 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 please do subscribe to the channel and share the content as well as, you know, give a thumbs up to the video. Anyway, so today is uh, day 5 of uh, the lockdown of India, the official lockdown, and uh, yeah, we've been stuck up at home, and oh, by the way, if you saw the footage up ahead, that was... Uh, a dog Ragnar uh, he howls every time there's a siren that happens uh, from a fire brigade this time or even if there was an ambulance you would do the same so yeah <laughs> that is funny and interesting anyway uh, so yeah today uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a video about how to adjust the payload of this uh, rear suspension of the bike I think somebody had asked me in the comment to make a video of the same so that's why I'm trying to make this video today quick short video because I don't have anything in mind or I didn't have anything in mind to make a video today so yeah that's it so i'll quickly show you how to adjust the payload of the bike and the good thing is all the tools that is needed to do the same is provided has been provided by ktm and in the toolkit itself so it's fairly simple uh just let me get the key from the inside and i'll show you quickly as you can see i've put my water bladder for drying uh so we got the key let's take out the toolkit Yep, this is all we need and uh, I think we'll have to use the extension. Yep. So these are the tool, two tools that you would uh, need to adjust the payload the rear of the rear suspension. Uh, so these tools, are, as you can see, it's already been provided by KTM in the toolkit. So all you need to do is put this in here and then... Uh, hang on. As you can see, there are notches here. Uh, hang on, right, how do I point it? Here. Uh, these are the notches where the tool would get in, and this is the current setting of my payload. Uh, so, one, two, three, it's the third notch. So, I can uh, get it here so that it's slightly lower and softer as well. The higher it goes, it's uh, the harder the suspension is, and the lower it gets, the uh, softer it is. So, what you can do is uh, put it here and you know, change it. Let me show it to you. The only catch is you'll have to pull it. Uh, there we go. Uh -huh. Hang on. Getting there. Okay. And I pull now. Uh, so yeah it takes some effort and as you can see we have adjusted to a notch lower so it should be slightly softer now uh, that's so that's about it I might be wrong about the setting being softer or harder so if I'm wrong please correct me in the settings itself uh, I mean in the comments also I just noticed that you know the manufacturing date of the shock absorber is written here 240220 that's pretty awesome anyway so that's about it uh, that's how you adjust the preload of the rear suspension of the ktm 390 adventure uh if you do like what i'm making please subscribe to the channel and that's about it for today's short video didn't have any plan to make any video but since i said i would try to make one video every day for the next 21 days that's why i'm here anyway so that's about it bye bye take care stay inside stay safe